Hello and welcome to another episode of Vanilla SMP Bedrock Edition with Dariana and Lady Random. Uh, where are we, Dari? <laughs> we are in the new flower farm. Yay! Yay! Okay, this only works for um, flowers that are too high. Okay. Um, but I thought, seeing as we don't have a flower farm, that I would make one. Okay. Um, and this is my first time doing redstone, and I'm surprised that it actually works. Ooh, <laughs> can you show us? <laughs> okay, so, what you need to do is um, to flipper the switches, and as you can see, it uh, bone meals the, uh, the flowers and um, pops them off. And underneath there is um, a rail track um, with hoppers that uh, bring the flowers all the way over to the harvested flower box. Yay! Whoa. Wow, that's racked up really quick. And there's some more too. Yeah. <laughs> wow. Okay. Wow. And then, um, to make sure that we have a good supply of bone meal, I have another hopper track set here. So if you flip it to this switch, um, it takes the bone meal off and um, drops it off at the dispensers. Oh, cool. That's really cool. So, yeah. So that's the flower farm. Wow. Okay. Great. I can't believe it works. <laughs> yeah. That's awesome. That's fantastic. It's yeah. It's really cool. Oh, I made a little farm too. It's just right over here next to this one, actually. I apologize everybody if you hear the cat going crazy, he's just lonely today, so <laughs> Yeah. Anyways, this is the sea pickle farm. And so you can see there's uh three chests with a bunch of sea pickles in there. Now this thing supposedly will do like twenty five thousand sea pickles an hour. <laughs> wow. wow. <laughs> but uh is that, is, is that why we have an off switch up there? <laughs> Well, yeah, and it's it's noisy too because there's pistons involved here. So if you turn this on, it's like dispensing bone meal onto sea pickle in the in the middle, that uh, causes them to spread out to the um, coral that's around them, and then the pistons just kind of mash them down. Wow. And the center one will fill up faster than the uh, than the two outside ones, but uh, uh, that's pretty much it. That's pretty cool. All right. And then if, if you come around the back here, there's the ladder that leads up to the roof. And then there's trap doors here. And then you just kind of reach in and the, the dispenser is like right underneath that block with the redstone on it. So you can just yeah. fill that up with bone meal. Yeah, those three chests there will fill in probably about 30 minutes of, of AFK. So, um, also, uh, sea pickles can be used for lime dye. So, there's another flower dye for you there, Dari. Oh, nice. Yeah. Now, I did start lighting up the river a little bit, but there's still lots of dark spots in there, so you can still see drowned in the river. Yeah. Yeah, so. But, yeah, you put down up to four pickles in a spot. Uh, the more pickles you put down, the the more light you get out of them. So I'm just been putting down four at a time. So that's pretty cool. that the only other thing I did is I dug out a little bit more downstairs but we don't need to see that and I did a little bit of digging out at the witch farm but uh, cool. I started on an area out there and this cat's gonna drive me nuts today so <laughs> anyways um, 
I was thinking we might do a little bit of an adventure today if you guys are up to it. Yeah. yeah. I've got. We haven't an... done an adventure for ages. Yeah, hang on a second. Let me let's uh, come over this way, and I've got something to show you. It just sticks on every once in a while when you log into the realm. Alright. I really need to pretty the farm up. <laughs> it's ugly. <laughs> I just need to add some uh, wood to, to blend in with all the other uh, buildings. It's fine. It's oh, functional. Okay. It's, yeah, there's some baby sound. Right? Had a bunch of extra carrots that I threw down, and well, now we got more villagers. Uh, so <laughs> they haven't been breeding because nobody's making carrots or anything. I guess they ate them all. <laughs> we're starving them to death here. <laughs> I think I got it in here. There you go. What is Ocean it? Explorer map. Ooh, yeah. We you know. Let me let me hand this to you <laughs> later on. Let's have a look at that. Ooh. Oh, look at that. Okay. Ooh, exciting. So uh, we want to at least find it and look at it. I don't know uh, if we're daring enough to go inside of it or not. <laughs> but uh, but everybody should. Everybody should be kitted up pretty much. I mean, Dari, you don't have very many um, enchants on your equipment, though. I think we got some some depth strider, maybe some uh, protection or uh, blast protection or something. You have? You said you. What do you have on your helmet again? I've got Aqua Infinity. Okay. Um, but that. Oh, and a respiration. And rest free. Okay, so so, so you're good there. That's good. But you also found a uh, heart of the sea, didn't you? A heart of the ocean, whatever it's called. I did. Is it in the precious? Yes, it is. Okay, and it's in the okay, and are there any um, novelist shells here in random bits? Maybe. Yeah. Grab like nine um, novelist shells, or eight of them. I'm sorry. Okay, and then put them in the crafting table. Put your heart of the ocean in the center and surround it by eight nautilus shells. Okay, done. Ooh, a what conduit. A conduit. Okay, cool. Now yep. we're we're gonna get some prismarine from the um, from the ocean monument, okay. and then um, we can use that to make a, a conduit underwater so that we can breathe. And I think it helps didn't light things up. Some, didn't we have some prismarine? I don't know if or there's... does it need to be the... Um, no, the... it can be used any prismarine, but I don't think we have enough. How much okay. do we have left? Um, I'm not sure. Um, I don't know what I did with it. I, I know I had some. Mm. I, might have, I might have put it in my house. I'll go and have a look. Okay. Or I could have left it down in the storage room. Alright. Alright, well while she's looking for that, why don't we grab some supplies that we can take with us, like some food and maybe yeah. some torches and stuff like that. Um Right, well I've got a load of baked potatoes here. Should okay. Potatoes yeah, that's fine. I can grab some chicken or some fish since that's filled up. Yes, we've got dark prismarine and some prismarine stairs. So we've got 42 dark prismarine. That might be enough. The stairs won't do anything, but uh, if we have blocks. Yeah, I'll go and have a look um, in the uh, chest that we used for building the monument yes, uh, last week. Okay. Yesterday. Oh, this week has been such a blur. <laughs> Stack of fish. Maybe some salmon too. 
Ah, ok. Yeah, it's prismarine crystals and just some more prismarine stairs. Other than that, it's just the dark prismarine that we've got. We've got 42 of them. There you go, dude. Why don't you go back there? You're a librarian. There you go. Now you work in the fish and chip shop. Yay. What does he trade? <laughs> Let's see. 24 paper for an emerald. Six emeralds for a bookshelf. I don't know what... Oh, he's still level one. But um, he's got an uh, enchanted book here. We just have to open him up. But... Now, but now we've got an employee and we got somebody here shopping. The butcher's over here shopping, so. We've got so many fishermen. <laughs> Everybody's a fisherman in there. <laughs> we, just because we have so many barrels, I mean, I see him stand here in front of the bushes using the planters as a. And then because behind the actual fishing shack, there's uh, like a, oh, 12 barrels back there. So, yeah. <laughs> so that's well, why. I really... Yeah. See, he's I using that one over there. <laughs> oh, no, he's walked away. But... <sighs> I'm going to put the iron back and grab some um, lapis and then enchant my stuff. Oh, let me grab some uh, torches real quick, too. That's a good point, actually. I only have them. I have like 37, but I'll make a yeah. couple of stacks real quick. two and a half stacks of torches so alright you enchanting we have tons of books downstairs I'm breaking on my chest plate I don't think so I forgot about the one downstairs we have tons of them, and LR has organized them all. <laughs> I've got 22 levels if you need any. I've got seven. <laughs> I've got 57, so. <laughs> wow. I need to get on with things, don't I? Seven. I'm dying, I think. I really have more. <laughs> seven, well, that's me... so cool. Let me come down and I will donate some levels to you. Yeah. It's all the way down, isn't it? Yep. Do you want me to grab a silk touch pick as well in case we get 
think I've got one. Um, yeah, there should be one in the chest, but we can definitely grab it. I've got a fortune pick, but... Uh, fortune, fortune Where am I going? Down here to the spider, or the skeleton spawner. Oh, yeah. In this episode, we learned that Dariana is a derp. Okay, know what so, doing. let's see. LR's kind of broken these down. There's some chest plates and chants. Oh, wow. Leggings, boots. Um, and, and then this is a whole bunch of stuff that I just got recently. There's like a blast protection for and feather falling and stuff like that in there. What is Riptide? Riptide is used with the um, the, the, the trident. Yeah, if you, if you use that, that's the one that kind of propels you through the water. And if it's raining out and you've got elytra, you can use it to jump out of the water and fly. I've just chucked you a um, step strider three book. Thank you. Yep. Hopefully this, um, yeah, it looks like it's so good. Handbill. It's over here, by the skelly spawner, right there. Okay. You make sure you put it in the anvil and not the uh, grindstone. You don't want to remove <laughs> the <Yeah>. enchants. <laughs> okay, I can't actually do enchanting. You don't have enough levels? Okay. I don't have enough levels. Okay, what do you want on there? Um, I've got 57 levels. Okay, um, on those boots, I would like that one. Okay. Boots, you want. Dev Strider and Feather Polly? Okay. Um, Riptide, does it need to be on anything particular? It has to go on the, um, the Trident. Oh, okay. I haven't got a trident with me, so... Well, we have a few, so... <laughs> Help yourself, if, if you want. Um, Ella, you want to grab her a trident? Yeah, I'm going to get some trident. Okay. I, I, think you, I think you took my boots back. Did I? Oh, sorry. There you go. <laughs> okay. Alright. I got 47 levels left, so... Chest plate or leggings? That's another uh, trident one. Oh no, 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 impaling. Is that a tri that's a trident, I think. Um, Yeah, I'm pretty sure that one's that one's a trident, and uh, what's the one that's for the um, crossbow is I can't remember anymore. Do you want to try to pull up? Piercing. Yeah. Uh, yeah, we may as well. It's not like we don't have the. Uh... Also, if if you're gonna put on tridents, um, let's see what we have. Loyalty is another one that you'll want. Because loyalty, when you throw the trident, it'll come back to you. Kind of like a boomerang. Uh, like, a, like a boomerang. Yeah. I only see one loyalty in the box here. There might be some of the other. Okay. The other one's attached to some other material. Okay, impaling, mending. Channeling is uh, an interesting one. Uh, if, if it's a thunderstorm, you can um, make lightning strike. 
So if you want to make charged creepers, <laughs> you can. Because absolutely, I, I, I look forward to doing that kind of thing. <laughs> well, see, there is a way of getting um, actually wither skeleton skulls without going to the nether. <laughs> Yeah, um, the strays that you find in, um, in like the frozen biomes. Yeah. If you can get those to get blown up by a charged creeper, they drop wither skulls. Oh, cool. Three here. Okay. You want that on your trident? Yeah. Oh, okay. Okay, right. Oh, there's one with mending here as well. Okay. Yeah. Alright. Oh, God, I got to show you this. I found, I figured out while I was doing some stuff in here. You know how we get the occasional uh, uh, gold helmet or something like that? Oh, right, yeah, yeah. If you come into the blast furnace and you put in, you know, uh, an item to smelt, yep. use these junk bows. One bow will smelt that item down. Oh, perfect. It's worth getting rid of those, isn't it? Yeah. So that's what I've been kind of doing is just <laughs> getting rid of them and then getting a tiny bit of experience out of that. But... Uh, yeah, and then lately too, the they seem to be dropping with um, full bows. So I think it's a bug at the moment. Oh, I love me at last. Sorry, what I meant was, goodness, I really hope they fix that quickly. <laughs> <laughs> but we, we don't need that many bows. <laughs> I mean, this chest I got. 27 of them in here plus I don't know how many you have in here I think I took a bunch over to the armory yeah let's see this uh, we've got 54 bows in that chest so. yeah okay so what do you need enchanted now Okay, I'm just gonna bunch of them. Okay, I would like on my diamond chest plate this book. Okay. Uh, your diamond chest plate. I just gave it back to myself. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> That just puts projectile protection on it. Okay, do you want mending or anything on these? Oh, um, yes, if there is a mending. There should be mending books in here. Let me see. Blast protection. Okay. Uh, yeah, that's projectile protection. Well, we can do that. That'll put. We don't need all that other stuff. Put mending on those. Projectile protection and mending. Yep. Right. And we got 40 levels and left. Okay. More projectiles. Okay. Okay, let me see if there's another mending book over there. three, I think, but uh, no big deal. Alright, so, leggings. So, 
there you go. Projectile protection and ending. Oh, sorry, wrong person. <laughs> on. Jeez. But I, but I like a breeze between my knees. Uh. Oh, it might be a one or the other. Oh, really? Yeah. Okay, well, at least it'll come back to you. You might be able to put channeling on it. Loyalty and channeling. You out here in the chest. Oh, yeah. Now we we need to get some blaze powder so we can do some potions, and you can make potion arrows. Oh, that'll be good. Um, my sword needs. Okay. Fixing. Needs repairing. It, it, it's it's just an iron one though. Well, can we I make yourself a diamond them? one. I I found a bunch of diamonds yesterday. Well, not a bunch. I found like. 12 diamonds. I'll go and grab, I'll yeah. go and grab uh, a new one. Do, 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 do. Yeah, I can have loyalty and channeling. Okay, I've got 34 levels if you need anything. area and we'll make a, 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 a water elevator like we have over in the trident farm. Like the bubble elevator, the bubble yeah. <laughs> in here the other day using this the skeleton farm yeah and somehow a skeleton had spawned in this area down here so I'm over here doing this and he comes up the stairs and starts shooting me where they're coming from yeah yeah, yeah I, every once in a while like I'll, I'll be downstairs like when I was working on the um, slime farm and they will spawn like in the far corner of the area down there yeah I'm wondering if we need to um, take the floor down a half a block like we have in here and slab it. yeah slab it 
We can't do it in here though because of the um, the, the whole uh, bookshelf thing. But no, as long as it's lit up, it should be okay. There's just probably an area that's just got a, a, a light level of eight or something that's uh, allowing them to spawn in. I, I, I've got a, um, a tutorial for a um, farm that we could do out at the um, Ocean Monument and um, you don't have to tear out the, the monument actually to get the uh, the Guardian farm. Oh really? Yeah, it's, it's an interesting design where they use a bunch of nether portals and they push them into the nether into one spot and you can so one person stays on this side to spawn them in, the other yeah. person's in the nether, and then when you get a whole bunch of them, you throw a harming potion at them, and you get tons and tons and tons of experience off of it. Oh, wow. So. That's worth knowing. Yeah. Yeah, so that's another farm that's going to be in eventually. <laughs> so, yeah. up there with our big farms. Enchantments on your sword. Um, did you want your trident um, yep. enchanted, or did you already do that? Um, I haven't got a trident. Oh, LR's got one for it. Oh no, I've got I it here. Do, I'll get it to you, I think. Okay, what do you want on it? I've got a trident um, here. Um, you want loyalty on it so it comes back to you? Yeah, um, that's probably uh, probably gonna be the best thing, isn't it? I think there are some trident. Okay, the, let me see. Uh, Riptide, 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 <laughs> they're all Riptide. Yeah, I think there was some attached to other... Um, oh, other... We had loyalty in, the, in here. I think I placed a lot of those books before. Oh, I've got one here. Okay. I've got one. I've got one here. Okay. You want channeling on it too? So that way you can uh, summon lightning and make charge creepers? Absolutely. Let me find get that one for you. and you get impaling on it too, so. There you go. Thank you. You're welcome. I'm gonna put anything on mine. Sorry for torches. I've got... Um, I've got 64. Okay, I've got like two and a half stacks, so. There's another 64 there for you.